Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to the channel. Uh, this time, a uh, small, short tutorial, I guess, video. Uh, people were asking, how do you create a AI race with a custom car, not the Porsche car? So we open the AI race, I racing uh, UI. We go to AI racing. As you can see, you have the Porsche Cup as predefined season. That's a whole season. Um, we can create a, our own custom season or we can create a single race. Uh, let's start with a single race. We go to single race. Uh, you start with adding what track you want to race. Let's go Phoenix Raceway. Uh, something. Uh, then you can select the weather uh, manually or automatically. Then you can set up the race sessions like practice, qualifier, or race. You can advance any of the practice or qualifier sessions manually forward, so you can get directly to race. Or, or if you want to actually the AI to AI to qualify, then probably you have to wait a little bit. Uh, then it's the race set, set the settings. Uh, enable disable car damage. Uh, uh, qualifying conduct scrutiny off. This is the thing that is applied in official races. The higher the license class, the stricter the qualifying conduct. For example, you can't do burnouts before the start and so on. So up to you. Uh, if you want to play around, disable car damage and go all nuts on the AI. And then you can select the car. Uh, here is the list of all available cars uh, for the AI racing. So it's not only Porsche Cup as some people initially said. Uh, Audi, BMW, M4, uh, Dallara, uh, yeah, Porsche, Cayman, oh, oh yeah, uh, let's go with BMW M4, interestingly that I can select it, because I haven't bought the car. Opponents, this is, you can select the GD4 car, uh, the whole class or you can select a specific only one car if you want to. So for example, if you will do the GT3s, you can get the this whole VRS uh, class. Here comes the number of how many drivers. So from one to 43, I guess this is the limit of a track. I think it can go up to 60 or, or 59. Uh, and the skill spread, how strong is your AI opponent? Rookies. Amateurs, hot shoes, pros, aliens, cheaters. Uh, start, race type, uh, rolling start, standing start, um, double file, this is the restart thing. Uh, how many fast repairs? Uh, or no limit of fast repairs? Do we have a joker lap? That's for, uh, for the uh, uh, rally cross. Uh, track conditions, the marbles on track and so on, and time of the day when the race happens. Specific time or automatic. And uh, when you press continue, it sends you to... You can create your own race session. That's for the single AI race. If you want to do more fun, uh, want to do a season, like the, there is a predefined Porsche Cup season. So you go to create a season. You name your season. Uh, you select what tracks you want to drive in this season. So, uh, Interlagos, uh, Spa, Road America, so it's Cuba. Um, yeah, you select that. Again, weather. Let's go with the dynamic weather. Uh, race sessions, five minute practice, uh, three lap, two lap qualifier, 15 minute races, race options. Again, qualifying scrutiny, damage, uh, adding the car. Uh, let's do the GT3. Uh, is that a GT3? No, there is no GT3. <laughs> so yeah. So the thing is, you select this here. You select the car you want to drive, not the opponents. So yeah. Um, let's do the Cayman. So it's GT4 opponents, the whole GT4 class. So they're randomized by cars again. Skill spread, let's do pros, something like that. Track options, uh, rolling or standing start, um, single file, maintain, yeah, maintain whatever. Fast repairs on one. Uh, full course yellows, yes, no, lucky dog. Uh, track conditions, 
time of the day. Uh, so here is the. You can do a specific thing for each, each, each um, race. Uh, and then how much, how many points uh, for which position you get as the championship. Uh, it's the ovals, that's the GP. So something like Formula One, I guess. Uh, none. Custom, you do your own. And save. Uh, okay, uh, it already automatically gave us the, to start the first race. But yeah, here is your GT4 class season. Um, so yeah, thank you for watching. If this helped you, leave a like, leave a comment. Maybe something needs to be done better. Um, thanks for watching and uh, hope to see you on the track.